my best customs. I spent years painting each figure there little by little. And I had built a whole center section for them. Wasn't real happy with it. And then this third party company came out with the center section to go with the Hasbro figures, which are his limbs. That figure got slept on. I uploaded it way too late, after no one cared about those video games anymore. I'm still not done with this. I have uh, Megatron half finished. I had to break him out for the hell of it. These two, actually Jazz was the last one I finished in Bumblebee. So I'd done that Jazz before and sold them on eBay. Sold a lot of customs on eBay. Back after the Michael Bay movies came out. Got on there and saw, actually it's when I started doing the custom Transformers. I saw a guy on there sell one supposedly for 3400 bucks. A little $20 figure from Walmart, from the stores. I was like, no way. I was looking at it. I was like, man, I can do that. I did the model cars as a kid. This was back in 2007. So I hadn't done any custom painting on an action figure, model car, or anything. All the way up to that point. And when I saw that, that's all it took for me to get motivated to want to do something. I never had any custom sell for that price, but I made some decent, I made a little bit of income from doing it and enjoyed it at the same time. And then after I had my run for a few years of painting them and selling them on eBay, feeling like I made a name, Matt 1989 cars that came from eBay. So I felt like people were getting to know me through that name. And I came over to YouTube, started uploading the stuff on YouTube and kept the same name. Actually switched my name on YouTube to Matt 1989 Cars. I don't even remember what I originally had it as. This is a collection that I've slowly worked on too for myself after I got done selling them. Every one of these was taken apart into every little individual piece and hand painted and sprayed and cleared. It's the oldest and first one I did out of this bunch. And the last one I worked on was Jazz. out of this group on top of here. Funny, last one I did on Father Cybertron was Jazz and the last one I did up here was Jazz. Huh. Well, I just finished him up mm, a couple few years ago. He might have been the very last action figure I did if I'm not mistaken. I need to get back into that. There's some more waiting to be painted down here that go with the or for Cybertron, Fall of Cybertron versions. Tell you what, that War for Cybertron, man, that was my favorite game ever. I was a beast on that game. And they shut the servers down on me. Everybody was hacking in God mode anyways. You couldn't even find a decent lobby. Here's a Meg. Megatron. Break them down. I cheated a little bit on this one. I didn't break him all the way down. I almost always break him completely down. But this guy wasn't getting any gloss paint. It's all hand painted, every bit of it. It's flat. I left more of it together than normal. I still had to get into some of those nooks and crannies. I progressed in. I progressed and progressed and progressed along with a lot of other people in custom painting these guys. When everybody first started painting them along with myself, we were all leaving the plastic body panels to the cars and vehicles, just whatever the plastic. 
and everybody was doing what's called dry brushing on the limbs to make them look like metal. That was stage one of customizing them. And then some people started, we started getting a little more with it, painting the body panels. And I said, man, hold on. What stands out and is an eyesore on this? It's like when you leave the back side of a panel, the plastic yellow, and have it painted out here all nice. And then when you turn it a certain way and look in the background, you're like, oh, you got some original plastic sticking out there. So I started painting every nook and cranny on these. Everywhere. And it can keep going. It can, it can never, you know, you can keep going and going and going and going. Yeah, I'm going to finish him, that yellow challenger. Oh, com the very last commission job that I took was from someone I worked with often. I'm not even going to break it out. It's a third party perceptor that went with the Fala Cybertron. Nate, I don't know if you watch, Nathan, I don't know if you watch my videos still, but I ain't forgot about you, brother. As soon as I can get back into fooling with these small parts. My kids are gone tonight. The grandmother's watching them. So I was able to work today, and now I'm spending my night with these videos. I gotta clean all this up by tomorrow. I had the kids back running around. Although she stays out of this room. But then this room's my work room. And I gotta keep the money flow going. I don't get much time to do these things. I'll make it though, right? We gotta make time for what we want to do. To leave some of this out. I have plenty of things keep me busy, that's for sure. Plenty of things in my mind I want to do. I think that's important in this life. If you walk around and let everybody else fill your mind up with bullshit, you won't ever get anything accomplished. I don't watch the news or the weather or I don't pay attention to negative people, all that kind of stuff anymore. I ain't trying to give them free rent in my mind, free space in my mind, whatever. People say, what, what is it? Out of sight, out of mind? I like to say out of mind, out of sight. E. Help each other out out there. This is me trying to do my part. Some motivation. If I got stuff you like, I know I can't take this stuff with me. So most of it will be sold one day. Some of it will be given away. Some of it will be traded. Here, let's start with this one. I messed up and bought doubles. Any, any of you guys that have been... Uh, collecting transformers need that I couldn't find them on the shelves for the longest and all of a sudden he popped up and I don't went overboard I don't forgot I found it before so we're gonna revisit this on the hot wheels get all this other stuff out the way get a couple of these hot wheels done and move on to the model cars and uh, a couple transformers I mentioned I need to finish painting so check me out on Instagram same name Matt 1989 cars I'll do my best to, no, I won't do my best I will when I finish anything custom whether it's a hot wheel a transformer model car I'll take some real nice pictures and I'll just upload a little shot on Instagram. And then every now and then I'll squeeze some of these videos in. Uh, I gotta get back to the cars next. I got the Impala I gotta finish. So that's what will be uploaded next. 96 Impala. Back to it. 
and we'll see what comes after that thing. Thanks for watching, guys. I think I could keep going on and on and on. I'll save it for another bunch, another batch of videos, whatever. Let me know, too, in the comments if there was something I could speak more on. I'd be more than glad to make a video just for you. Much love. Peace. I need Predakeen. <laughs>